You, go on. you do more than council business, you do? I do, Ollie, yeah, we're at the, at the farm in today, the, the, the ponies. Do you have an interest in the ponies? Yeah, yeah, I got into the Connemaras a few years ago and um, I got the, once you got bitten by that bug, it's sort of, it's sort of all snowballs from there and now I have a big family of them. Are they Connemaras, all these? Or? All Connemaras. Here you have uh, Molly, my, uh, my brood there, and her, her foal, Magic Millie. And Ballard, Ballard's a written pony, five-year-old written pony, so we're hoping to do lots of business here today. And what's the story of Connemara ponies? Uh, Connemaras are our, our native ponies, the most versatile uh, uh, horse in the in the business. And, uh, but unfortunately, like uh, all of the equine market at the moment, is depressed. But uh, we're struggling on with them. And where do they originate? Are they in Ireland or do they come from abroad? Oh, they're a native breed, but there's like all like all uh, I suppose horses. There's uh, there's some. Uh, foreign blood in there in, in places and then some foreign blood was introduced at various stages to uh, to uh, help the help the breed and get new new attributes in into the breed. The town manager you're the town manager at the moment, uh, you support all this kind of stuff on the street, you do, yeah? Oh well it's good. You can see there's a bit of uh, a bit of life and a bit of diversity around the around the town this morning and uh, it's uh, hopefully will uh, bring a little bit of business into the town for for the day and it's uh, it's good to be inclusive in terms of uh, getting up the farming community from around uh, in on the streets in the town to for for, for the morning. Great to see it. All right, thanks. Thanks a million. Okay.